Hello there boys and girls, welcome to Scottish Geeks. Today we're going to be taking a quick look at Franbo. This is the demo version of a game that I'm actually quite looking forward to because I love point and click adventures and as you guys know I love my horror games. And this game, even the title screen, is quite creepy. Check this out, seriously, it is so weird. Anyway, so there is a full game coming out on Steam soon and I will be getting it. Anyway, let's click new game. This game uses an autosave feature, I found that. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. Oh, isn't that nice? I see my parents. There they are. There's mum and there's dad. Or is it the other way around? They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder, is it a basket of fish heads? Mm, lovely! Oh, it's cat. So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. Sorry, she's turned weird now. It's Mr. Midnight. Hello, Mr. Midnight. My best friend in all the land. My only friend. You guys are my friends. We are having dinner and I see Aunt Grace too. Oh yeah, Aunt Grace is great. She gives us money every Christmas. I really like her a lot. Aunt Grace is amazing. Oh, where's she going? Oh, it's my parents are going. My parents are going out. It's Friday. Oh, they're going to the cinema. I see. I Grace takes good care of me, and slips me a five now and again. We're having so much fun, isn't it lovely? It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight, my funky little kitty cat. But something feels real bad. <gasps> oh! There's somebody at the door! A strange creature inside my window. What could it be? I don't like it! It scares me. Chatter, 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 Neville, Neville, Neville. Sorry, I can't be speaking of voices. Suddenly I hear something. What is it? It's Mum! Screaming! I want to know what's wrong. So, of course, I'm gonna go and check it out. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And then more. <gasps> there she is. And closer. And closer. It's a knife. Mom? Dad? Please, please don't. My. <gasps> Mommy? Daddy? Oh. Oh, that's nasty. So we ran away from the house that filled with blood. I fell over and hurt my ankle and my cat rubbed my ass for no reason. He was just like that. Cats, cats do that kind of thing. Oh no, oh, of course, no, the cat's fucking off. Yeah. Oh well, thanks, Mr. Midnight. Who's this? Hello, strange cloak person. I trust you implicitly with my life. Of course! Fran, please follow my voice. In the count of three, you will wake up. Have we been asleep this whole time? One. Two. <gasps> We're awake! Three. Here we are. Fran, how do you feel? Uh, fine, I guess. Just sad to see the same things. Sadness is something everybody has within. I want to go home. Yeah. You can't go home, Fran. You've got to get well. I need my cat. I have to get out of here. I need my cat. If your cat is missing, it would be impossible to get him back. If you're fucking right. But now I have something for you, Fran. Ooh, really? Ooh, really? See, Dexter, there's a little package for you. Oh, awesome. Thank you. It's for my grace. Take it. Okay, I've got it. That's my mother's purse. There we go, I've got a purse now. There's something inside, okay. What's this? Examine. Here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. Very specific! So I hope you'll always keep this purse, give it, and all the other things you find a good use. 
Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love Aunt Grace. See, I told you Aunt Grace was awesome. She's worried about you. Well, obviously, Aunt Grace is brilliant. Aunt Grace. Well, another reason to let me go then, obviously. She's fine. Uh, can I leave now then? Can I go to my room? Yeah, I can leave. But before you do, it's time for your new medicine. Oh, God. What medicine? I... Mm. It's called duotine, and it'll make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready! Ah, she's creepy. Anything new today, Dr. Dean? Nothing, actually. St. Vicious is bizarre. Oh, I see. Here, Fran, take your medicine. Ah, oh, fine. Thank you. Mmm! Mmm, that's delicious. Delicious medicine. I don't feel good. Whoa! What the fuck? Well! Whoa! Oh no! Trying to back to my room. Yeah, it's so. What? I've started doing voices now. I could be asked earlier on. And I'll probably forget the voices I've done. And now I still don't know to take this out again. It's one of those things, I do these things, I don't know why. What do you want for me? Ding dong, beware, Franbo. If you leave the house of madness, what? I will hunt you down. No, you fucking will, I'm gonna jab you with my pointer. Catch you. No, you would! And bring you back to insanity. Well, actually, that's not a problem. I'm already insane, okay? Guys, I don't suffer from it. I enjoy it immensely. The medicine will help you escape. Thank you, Mr. Midnight. What the fuck have you been? Oh, you've been in the forest, have you? Well, that's just lovely. Oh, he loves me. Liar! Liar! My sober day. Some demo this actually, it's quite long. Hmm. Right, so what have we got here? Oh great, a clown picture. Fantastic. A carousel. Oh. So are we lying down or are we praying on our knees? I can't really tell. What do we do? I'm still here. Who do this place? Yeah. I've gotta get out of here. Yeah, that'd probably be a good idea. Eyeballs, eyeballs everywhere, not a drop to drink. What's this? Oh, that's pretty. Can we bong it? I will get your nose. I will get it. I want that nose. Are you happy, clown? Can you make me laugh? What have we got in the drawer here? Locked. Good reason to get curious. Case 25062009150000. Name Fran Bo Dagenart. Age 10. Gender female. History. The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bo Dagenart family tragedy. Details omitted. Dr. Marcel Dierne has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of side effects. Psycho... what? I'm not that for sure. Why have I got cross? Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. Well, yeah, that is a concern. Red and tiny, you are hiding from me. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he's afraid. He told me that medicine would show me where he is. I hate the monster. Okay, well, let's go this way. Hi, guys. How's it going? Hello, Phil. Hello. Uh, how are you getting on? How are you, Phil? Everybody says that I'm sick. Uh, they're just stupid. They'll say that. Are you leaving tonight? Uh, I will if you help me. Yeah, you gotta help me, dude. The office is the key. There's a key inside? Cause I need a key, I need a key for that drawer. I still thought to write a secret code. Oh, oh, what is it? What's the secret code? He doesn't want me to tell you. Tell, tell me. Who, who doesn't want me to tell you? What, who, yes, who? Him, him who? There's nobody, th whoa! Holy shit! the fuck is that? Hold oh, those glows, you're a prisoner of my games and nobody will help you escape. 
That's creepy. Well, fine. Leave me alone. I hate you. What about Mr. Teddy? Mommy. Daddy. I need you so much. No. I won't let that monster stop me. Oh my god. It's right. I want the Teddy. I hope somebody loves you. A little box here. Ooh, a secret box. Shh. Let's examine it. That box is open. Okay, let's use it then. <gasps> the key! The key! Nice! Okay. Alright, we'll come back at the posters now. Go back over here. So maybe the key will open this. Use it on that. Yes, I got it! And there's something inside. What's in there? Um, examine that. There's a photograph of me and my family. I've guarded us with my life. What else have we got in here? Draws empty. Uh, and uh, a, a pin, a hairpin that looks like a bow. My hair clip, I should give it a good use. Okay, let's use the hair clip. My hair. Yeah, okay. Anyway, moving on, let's go this way. Uh, the legs are just fine, okay. Is there anything over here we can use? Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. I don't need any towels, don't give me any towels. Maybe we can have a cup of coffee. I wonder what she's writing? I'm curious. Let's ask her. Good old friend. Good to see you awake. How long was I asleep for? Three day three days! Three fucking days! Wow. Okay. Was it the medicine? I don't know. Was it? Yeah, it was the medicine. That's why you're not taking it again. Oh alright. Uh, what's that? I guess the nurse would never let me touch anything. Yeah, we need to get rid of the nurse somehow. Right, let's go for a little adventure somewhere. So I shot in a rocking horse, it might be nice. Oh, wooden Mr. Horse, are you having a good time? I used to have a blue dress like yours. So this is Fillmore Brunson. He's eight and he's a male. History, the patient came to Oswald to sell him with his mother, Rachel Brunson. The boy has developed paranoid behaviour. Paranoia not yet diagnosed. The treatment is daily treatment with Dr. Marcel Dearn. We have not achieved the patient's trust and refuses to be questioned. Well, the thing is, I think that's a bit odd. Let's use that in the door. That's but the tools, I need something else. What else could I use? What could I use? Oh god, dang it. It's gonna be something else I could use. If I sit down, it will eventually get up, so what's the point? We need something else. We need something different. I wonder. Can you help me, Dad? Did you find a doctor to call Jets in the office? I didn't. Yeah, we need to get somewhere else. Uh, there's the bed. I wonder. I just woke up. What's that? The drawer is empty. Maybe it's something behind here. Whoa! A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. No, I'm going to use it to open that fucking door. Okay, so maybe I can combine these two. Okay, maybe we can use that in the door. If we use that, the shape is not right. Well, shit. Hmm. Let's keep looking, shall we? Is there anything else in this curtain rod? I guess if I broke the curtains down, I can look outside. Okay, let's have a look outside. Tower defense. We have for you a crazy person called Fran. Or is it defense tower? I guess that's my way out. I thought my head would fit through the window though. Well, okay. I want that nose. Uh, maybe I could use the hook to get it. Use it on his nose. Won't work. Uh, let's try using this to get his nose. Nothing, of course. Is there anything else I could do around here? Uh, is there anything in these drawers? Maybe we can look at this window. There's a swing park out there. Playground. Good night, trees and men. Pretty sure the playground isn't a good escape route. Okay. But this window. It's all boarded up. Not so easy to see through it. But I can still see the playground. That is the playground. Okay, good, good, good. Right, so we just need to continue our search. Is that a cup of coffee? 
I really want you. I would really want something. I know your legs are fine. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Use that with the nurse. Oh, well, fine. So there's going to be something around here we can use. Let's talk to Teddy again. I can't get to the office. Let's try it with him. Okay, can we use the hook on him? Why not? Okay, let's use the that on the wooden horse. No. What is it that I need? I need something. Gods, okay, keep looking around, okay. Um Yeah, I know you just woke up, dude. The drawer is empty. Okay, let's use let's try using something on each one. You can try that. Club. I should just give it a good use. I'm trying to. I can't think of anything to, to use it on. Uh, got to be something I can use around here. Can I just walk around the table? Let's talk to her again, see if she's got any more information. Yeah, I am awake. Yes. Yes, I am. What? What did I do? What what did I do wrong to? What's wrong? What did I do? I broke the curtains. Yeah, sorry. <gasps> oh yay! Okay, something's happening here. Okay. Well, let's go and talk to the nurse. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains? Uh, what's a hook? Yeah. We'll have to go and find something to fix this, you little girl. Okay. Okay, now we can check out stuff here. Right, okay. We've got here. Alright. What's this? Band aid, cake, patches. Okay, ew, coffee. What a trauma could have, uh, Great impact to children totally changes their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe defects in some abilities, such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to severe symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other world, other people are not feeling safe in the world. This could be interpreted as paranoia. A drawing of the brain, frontal lobe, motor cortex, sensory cortex, parietal lobe, occipital lobe, and temporal lobe. This. I can't read that. Eight is H. Eight is H. Okay, so it's eight, nine, four, five. Eight, nine, four, five. What's that? A gun! No. I'll leave it as it was. I really need to get out of this place. Okay. Let's get out of here. Okay, eight, nine, four, five. Let's check this out. Examine it. Yeah, uh huh. Okay, let's use it. Eight, nine, four, two, three, four, five. There we are. The pills, they will help me. Okay. Let's go through here and I'm going to use my pills. Whoa! Holy shit! You can see, yes I can. Phil's playing with his uncle and the uncle's mad. MAD! Why is there a deer in the chair now? Oh no, your head fell off. I'll try to put your head back on. Oops a daisy. Can't help you, Mr. Deer. I'm sorry, I can't help you. At least that still looks normal. You having a good time? So this is the door to happiness. Of course it's locked. Okay, let's go this way. <gasps> stairs! The sta- what the hell is that? This game is so weird! Are you sleeping, sweet bunny? Bunny, wake up! Okay, let's go down these stairs. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know me. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. 
No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Franz's mental condition is not appropriate yet. See, I told you I would forget what the voice he sounded like. Holy fuck. Well, okay, we're back here. Was that real? Oh, dear. Aunt Grace. Why is there a fox in the bed? What is that? What's going on? And we'll find out when the full game comes out, of course. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, boys and girls. Please don't forget to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Please do share this video with your friends. We're almost at 7,000 subscribers. My birthday is on the 5th of September. Let's get to that 7,000 before my birthday. And you make me very, very happy. Anyway, thanks so much. And I'll catch you next time. But until then, bye-bye. <laughs>